It's literally like a Hasanabi stream reduced into two hundred two minutes and 49 seconds. Melon Raid? Wait, what do you mean? What, Melon was streaming today? Wait, did he actually review the Macklemore song? Oh, God. What did he think about it? He covered the Macklemore song? Here, I'll do it after this. He liked it? Oh, God. He said it was fire. Okay, well, I'm uncompromising. As a, as a new music listener, I'm uncompromising in, the, in my values. I think the message is great. I like Macklemore. I think he's phenomenal for doing such a wonderful thing. But if you, like, ask me if this is, like, a banger, I will never tell you that this is a banger, okay? It's cringe. It's for a good cause, but it's cringe. He gave it an 8 out of 10. No, he didn't. All right, everybody, give it to me, okay? Give it to me. Let's cover the goddamn Macklemore song. Let's do it. Gritting teeth. Thank you, Macklemore. Very based. That's how I feel, too. I'm going to do my audience-captured YouTube voice. Are you ready? Guys, Macklemore just released the song of the summer, and he's got a lot of bold claims that he's making, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to listen to it right now, and I'm going to probably say the Free Palestine by the end of this song. All right, let's take a look. I will say one thing. It's very well produced. The, the beat is actually great. The beat is actually great. The message I'm a fan of. You can't see the video because there's dead babies in it, okay? He's referring to Hens Hall. Wait, no way. Oh, you started La -Y -Y -Law? No, man. This is why chat keeps chirping about this. Yes. This is why whenever we talked about the rap beef between Drake and Kendrick Lamar, Half a Chat was like, why don't you cover MGK versus Eminem? Why don't you cover Eminem versus Benzino? Eminem, 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 Eminem. Eminem, greatest rapper of all time, white guy, Eminem. That's why. Anyway, the point is, it's a good song, okay? It's great. It's just not for me. Uh, that's it. It's like very Lin-Manuel Miranda-esque. That's all I'm saying. And I have no issue with you guys loving the shit out of this song, okay? The song is phenomenal. I love it, okay? He's talking about Kufi, bro. He's talking about Christian United for Israel. That's crazy. If he said, Blamo, baby, it's about time. Blamo, baby, let's free Palestine. You'd actually give it a chance. <sighs> Tom Morello. Honestly, Macklemore's Hins Hall is the most Rage Against the Machine song since Rage Against the Machine. You listen to 10 songs a year. Now the Kendrick Drake beef got you acting like a guru. I feel like chat is just not going to stop until I say I love it. This is unimaginably based. I love how based the song is. So to all of you, I say, this song is unimaginably based, dude. This is the song of the summer. I've never listened to a better song ever in my entire life. I will forever be listening to this song. Pass me the ox, okay? None of the hoes are scared. You know why? Because the hoes love a free Palestine, okay? We are not scaring the hoes tonight, folks. When we play this song, the song of the summer, the hoes are actually excited, elated, because they also are not afraid of a free Palestine. The only thing is that this song will absolutely piss off liberals because he says he's not he's not voting for Biden in, in the fall. And every liberal is going to be like, I guess Macklemore loves Donald Trump. So it'll piss off a lot of liberals. And honestly, it's always fun to piss off liberals. So, you know, Joe Brandon, you know, let's go, Brandon. I think it is wild that a dude who like <laughs> unironically portrayed himself as like an anti-semitic cartoon has the balls to come out and like openly and aggressively be in solidarity with the palestinians it is wild by the way i don't i'm not saying that he's like anti-semitic at all especially now for this song but it is kind of it is kind of ballsy that he's just like yeah fuck it i don't give a shit okay <laughs> respect what is this macklemore apologizes for anti-semitic jew costume as seth rogan hits out on twitter <laughs> look 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 I, I am unconditionally in support of Macklemore that part is 100% true I'm not being uh I'm not joking I'm not joking at all when I say this okay 100% in support of Macklemore that's I it, like seriously seriously told you it wasn't the full version wait there's more of this beautiful song I would like to hear more about it where is the full so I would love to hear the rest of the song no no it's good it's very good I would like to hear more of it I completely agree with you, but I enjoy the slander against you too much. So fuck you say this is the best song ever, you bitch. I am. It's the best. It's the song of the summer. God, it's such a great sample. Sh straight up. The beat is really 
good. The beat is really, really, really fucking good. The song is uh, by Fire. Uh, was it Firuz Anala Habibi? Respond to these allegations. Hassan, did you hear the new Macklemore song? I'm scared to say I like new Macklemore song because people will think I'm a nerd. But it's so good, bro. I can't stop bumping it. I love that shit. You know this is fake because I am not Hassan in his phone, okay? The real ones know he named my ass Augustus Glump or whatever the f that kid is. What is it, Gloomp? Bro, this is the full song. You just sent me the song again. So the full song is just this. Is there more to the song? I know you love reading annotations, bro. What do you mean? What annotations do I need for this? It's pretty, it's pretty clear cut. There is not a single double entendre in the song, brother. It's just saying like free Palestine, you know, which is cool. I, I am with it. I'm with the message. If you keep going, Macklemore is going to write a diss track on you. Guys, I like Macklemore. I like Macklemore. I am a fan of this song. I like that he made this song. I do think it's kind of cringe, but it doesn't matter. That was the end of the song. You guys suck for making me literally. Oh my God. It's cringe, but it's a net good because white people love this kind of shit. Oh no, for sure. With your breakdown on it. Okay. Chatters. What breakdown is necessary? It's literally like a, a, a Hasanabi stream reduced into two, two minutes and 49 seconds. Like what breakdown do you want from me on this? It's pretty obvious what he is saying. What did Fantano say about it? I, I want to know. I'm going to text him right now. I'm going to text him. Hold on. What did you say about the Macklemore song? This is one of those moments where the content is not fun for us. You must dissect it. Dude, yeah, this is the thing I don't understand. This is like literally, this is literally one of those instances where like all of the chat is literally like playing into this meme. And I feel like the meme is like making the content worse overall, but they don't care. They're just like aggressively leaning into it. You know what I mean? Like, is this fun for you guys? Like what's happening? I'm not going to play the Feyre song. Okay. Jesus Christ, dude. Like what, what do you think? Ugh, dude, let, let's look at the lyrics. Okay. Let's, let's, an let's look at the annotations. Intro. The main sample of the song is Anala Habibi by Lebanese icon Feyrouz. These people won't leave. We will not be moved by these intimidation tactics. As Sueda Polat said, the Turkish student activist in Columbia University, one of the, one of the mobilizers, one of the organizers. What is threatening about divesting and wanting peace? The problem isn't protest. This is what they're protesting. It goes, it goes against what our country is funding. Block the barricade until Palestine is free. Hey, block the barricade until Palestine is free. <laughs> when I was seven, I learned a lesson from Cuban Easy E. When I was in third grade, I thought I was gay. <laughs> Actors and badges protecting property in a system that was designed by white supremacy. I saw where your customers. We pay you to express our will. We will demand that when you say Macklemore is your favorite artist and he defeated both opponents in the Drake VK dot beef. You can pay off Meta. You can't pay off me. Politicians to serve by any means. APAC and Koofy and all the companies. So we're losing the black audience. We, I mean, what do you want me to do? Anyway, all right, we're, we're done with that. We're done with that. We're done with all of this, okay? I'm glad that Macklemore did this. Anybody who talks shit about him and says he's like anti-Semitic for this or whatever. Anyone and everyone can suck me, okay? I, we're, we're done with that proportion. Oh, Jesus Christ.